Feel relaxed, whatever the weather brings. Radox sponsors the weather on Channel 5. Hi there, I'm Sean Welby. Well, it's almost the weekend and I'm afraid to say we do have some rain and some showers in the forecast. Tonight, however, it's turning largely dry, staying fairly cloudy for most, perhaps foggy for some western areas, particularly over the hills in Wales. Now, you'll see this cold front actually gradually sinking its way southwards and then settling across the centre of Britain first thing tomorrow morning. This will bring some cloudy and damp conditions to much of England and Wales, but a brighter start for Northern Ireland, uh, Northern England and Scotland and potentially a bit drier as well, just one or two scattered showers showers filtering through on that westerly breeze. So into the afternoon, it's looking to stay fairly grey for many, but once again, it's a very muggy afternoon. Feel relaxed, whatever the weather brings. Radox sponsors the weather on Channel 5. The Pollen Count, sponsored by CheckerTrade.com. CheckerTrade, CheckerTrade.com. So for those of you who suffer with hay fever, here's the pollen levels for tomorrow. Now, they're staying moderate in Northern Ireland and Scotland. They've actually dropped in northwest England and Wales down to low levels. But for the east of England and the south, it's staying moderate to high. The Pollen Count, sponsored by CheckerTrade.com. CheckerTrade, CheckerTrade.com. 